Hello, and welcome to another Novastore training video. My name is Clay, and today we'll be covering the features available within the Nova Backup Professional line of products. In this video, we'll be covering the Backup tab. The Backup function of Nova Backup is the core of the software and will provide a single .nbd file containing all selected files and an index of the files available after they've been backed up. The benefits of the backup function include the ability to compress the backed up files, maintain file and security permissions, encrypt the backup files, maintain multiple versions of the backed up files, and backing up only the incremental or differential changes. At the home screen of the Nova Backup client, click the Backup tab. Once selected, choose the files you wish to back up. In this demo, you can see we've chosen my user profile. At the top of the application, I have named this job Backup Demo. Once you have selected the files you wish to back up, select the destination you wish to back up to, and then click Settings to access the advanced settings for this backup job. In a backup job, there are two important settings tabs, the Backup tab and the Encryption tab. Within the Backup tab of the Settings menu, you will find four primary sections. The first, which includes the options to compress the file, verify the data of the file, backup the security and file permissions, whether or not to eject the destination drive once completed, the option to force Nova Backup's database to be fully included, whether or not to copy any currently open files, drive letter management that allows Nova Backup to make sure it's writing to the correct drive regardless of current drive letter, and the option to copy empty folders within the backup job. The second section, or the destination of the backup file, the backup mode, and finally, the option to chunk or split the file produced by the backup. The write mode of Nova Backup is an important choice and is either overwrite or append. Choosing to overwrite will completely rewrite any previously created backup of the same name. Choosing append will create new backup files for each completed backup job and will utilize more hard drive space than overwriting. As an important note, with the overwrite option selected, you will be deleting previously created backups and may risk losing data. The backup mode option affects which files are backed up when you run the backup job. Nova Backup utilizes the Windows Archive bit to choose which files are backed up, and you can find a link to more information in the description below. There are four options within the backup mode. A full backup will back up all files selected and clear any currently set archive bits. An incremental backup will back up any files that currently have the archive bits set and then reset them like a full backup. Therefore, an incremental backup becomes only a backup of the files that have changed since your last backup. A differential backup will back up any files that currently have the archive bits set but it will not reset the archive bit. A differential is different from an incremental in that it will back up all files since your last full backup, regardless if they have been backed up in any previous differentials. Differential backups can be larger than incremental backups in file size. However, they take significantly less time to restore and reduce potential data inconsistencies. If you have the available drive space, our team recommends differential backups instead of incremental. A snapshot backup functions identically to a full backup, but it will not reset the archive bit. Using a combination of scheduled full backups and subsequent incremental or differential backups will create a set of manageable smaller backups that are not too large in file size and retain the most amounts of data. Within the Encryption tab of the Settings menu, you will be presented a drop-down box of available encryption types and a password prompt. The available encryption choices are AES, 128, 192, or 256-bit. 
or Blowfish. You can find links in the description below describing each of these backup types. Here, you can see I've chosen Blowfish and the password of Nova Backup. This concludes the Nova Backup backup job training video. If you have any questions, always feel free to check out support.novastore.com and submit a ticket to our support team.